Hello everyone and today we're going to be teaching you how you can upgrade or update the firmware of your Switch Pro controller. In here, as you can see, in the first time that you're going to be using the controller, and if you follow the manual, you just have to press Y and the home button together for 3 seconds so that it should connect to your Switch wirelessly. Apparently, due to the update of Nintendo, it will not connect. So we need to upgrade the firmware. But don't worry, it's just very easy. We just need the wire that came along with the device, as you can see on the screen, and also the upgrade executional file that we're going to be putting in the link down below. So please follow me. All right, so here, here in my PC, and as you can see, I have already downloaded the file that we're going to be using to update the firmware. So it's going to be in a zip file, so you just have to right-click on it and then click on Extract Files. So it's going to create a folder, and inside it is the software that we're going to use to update the firmware. Okay, so just double-click on the file inside the folder, and then as you can see here, the update firmware is still grayed out. So now let's proceed to connecting the wire to our PC. So I have this USB extension hub where I can connect my USB into the USB port. All right, next. So let's make sure that our controller is not blinking. Okay, and make sure to hold or press and hold this L3 button here. Okay, let's just hold it. And then insert the USB-C type cable into the controller. Okay, just hold it in. And as you can see on the screen, the update firmware is now clickable. So let's click on it and then that's it. Firmware is updated and click OK. And after that one, you just have to disconnect the controller from your PC. Now let's go back to our switch. So just go to the controller settings or controllers and then change grip slash order. And then following the manual, press home button and Y button together for three seconds until the light turns on. Okay. All right. Let's wait for it to be connected. I will not be pausing anything so that we can see how long it's going to take for the first time to connect. All right, so it just vibrated and now it's been detected. Press A and then, all right, it's working now. And it's connected successfully. Now to confirm, let's try it on a Switch Lite device. Okay, the same thing. Just go to controllers and then change grip slash order. Then press the home and Y button together until the light appears. Okay, let's wait for it to be detected. Nice, it's already detected. And then press A, okay. And then now oh, it's perfect. So that's it guys. If you want to update your firmware, just click on the link below so that you can have the executional file that we're going to use for this update. Thanks so much for watching and I hope this video helped you. Bye.